all right guys uh, we have seen there is two resistance and uh, the resistance and after that the broke this resistance here and price pulls up and again retrace this resistance now act as a support have you seen this is now becoming a support so we have seen this is a strong support and uh, that this supporting line respecting both side now you can see here it is becoming a support uh, resistance and the resistance now becoming support so we have seen this line so this one 2822 uh, 28227 that this line is respecting both sides support and resistance now question is that how to trade by using this support and resistance right now we have seen according to my analysis so after giving a big correction, this color retracement, so I'm looking for a buy. Remember, above this supporting line, I'm not going to take any sell. Have you got it? So if you want to see, just let me draw the Fibonacci. And sorry, 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 just a minute, Fibonacci are there, let me connect here. Let me connect this point. Okay. Now we have seen Fibonacci. This is uh, if I connect A point and this is B point from this area. So if you see, this is an impulsive wave I W, right? Uh, this is called impulsive wave. This one from this one. And uh, now we have seen this is a corrective wave, right? C W. Just a minute, corrective wave. And exactly, we have seen 61% retracement of AB, right? And this is called BC. So that means this is a AB point, and this is an impulsive wave, and corrective wave are showing BC is a 61% retracement of Fibonacci, right? This point, and now here. So, above this point, above this, this uh, retracement or you can say corrective wave and this is called C, I never gonna take any sell position in this area, above this area. So, that is the most important thing. Now, we are looking for, for the buy opportunity, for the buy entry, right. Now, let's check it, how candlestick pattern we have right now, behaving right now so if you want to see here we have seen long bearish candle right you can say like this dozy pattern also most of the people are thinking how it should become a dozy pattern so dozy pattern it's a like a uh, it's a forming two third right two third two oblique third so if this um, tail getter than this body so most of the trader are using this is a dozy pattern right various type of dozy pattern are there for more information you just visit to my website hornprofit.com and you will find every candlestick pattern right so where is our entry point today for before i start uh, like analyzing for entry and exit this is defan gogoi technical analyst of allies blue if you uh, if you are a new viewer, you just subscribe my channel and ring the bell icon. And when I'm releasing new content, so you will get the notification. Because every day we are doing live market analysis, right? And for evening session, you just um, subscribe my another channel. Uh, already I given a uh, link in this description and go there and just click and subscribe my another channel for evening analysis so uh, now for the entry point let me draw some support and resistance line so for support we have seen this was a pullback price reverse we have seen this is support now when i connect this supporting line exactly we have seen there is a hundred moving average are there and yesterday price just push up up to this level only again push down the price toward that 
So we have seen now it's becoming a resistance line. Correct. This is called a resistance right now. And another 200 moving average are there. Right. And the forming a support. Now price is in between this range. Now this is called no traded zone. Where is the no traded zone? <clears throat> Just a minute. Okay. <clears throat> Now we have seen this is no traded zone. So in this area, we never gonna take any position in this area, right? Okay. Now, can I sell after breaking this range here? Can I take a sell position or who people are option that are? Can I buy put option here for this area? But I'm not going to take any sell position or I'm not going to buy any put option because my target was here that was a support line it's a high probability to reverse so I'm looking for only buy if I'm not getting any buy opportunity so I'm not going to take any position right I leave the market today right now what is our buy opportunity so always you find out your entry and exit point in a daily of four hour time frame and after that go to small time frame and wait to till proper opportunity otherwise don't enter blindly in this market remember most important most important thing that is now we have seen this is a resistance line and yesterday that was a higher point and if you want to see according to this candle we have seen this is called inside bar right inside bar do you know what that call inside bar most of the people knows i think who people are following me right or you can say like that it is called harami pattern this is japanese word harami that means a pregnant woman right the, uh, she is a mother right long one this is a mother and this is a belly and inside this baby right this is called baby uh, that that word called in japanese word that is called harami but indian very slang language right okay whatever inside bar are uh, there so now we have seen if the break this level so we uh, we have seen this is a buy opportunity are uh, there here and uh, what is the level buy opportunity above the level of 2, 8, 9, 10. If the break this level, so we can go for buy, right? Okay, let's check in a small time. Man. That was daily, how it should look like. Now, for our, we have seen in that level, what that level, 2, 8, nine ten right okay in that level here exactly we have seen 200 moving average are there in a four hour time frame right so if the break this level so definitely we'll go by here right so let's check in a small time frame how it should look like for entry and exit uh, now we have seen this is uh, what call 15 minute time frame right now 15 minute time frame price is running in a sideway have you seen look always remember when price stays sideway they are preparing for a big moment remember so have you seen that was a sideway sideway that a long moment right sideway right sideway long moment and then now same sideway sideway here will be a long movement right so all right now question is that in which direction will go for buy but remember today i am not going to take any sell position they break this lower point who have who already we see in this support and resistance in this level so till this area I am not interested to most of the people are doing trade but I am not interested to take sell position remember 
so most of the people are doing here we have seen so i think 200 moving average will be here like that and the price will be like that like that right so after breaking this area so we'll go for buy right so that is my trading strategy today so for the sell i'm waiting to break this level right if price break this 28 to 27 level in this level so i'll start selling below this area but in between this range i don't want to take any sell position right for the buy i'm looking for to break this 200 moving average right now so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe thanks for watching